question from some people on how I prepare my makeup every morning and whether it costs me a lot of time to do it I'm going to answer the question by showing you how to prepare my makeup in 10 minutes so we shall start with moisturizer I'm using the Origins Ginseng Energizing Daily Cream as a base this moisturizer is very nice it's not oily and not sticky at all and it's suitable for the oily skin like mine next I'm using the makeover primer in lavender I like the lavender color because it's bringing my skin one tone up and make it more brightened so for the foundation I love the texture of the Maybelline Fit Me Made in Poreless. I'm using the stippling brush for, from Real Techniques to apply and by stippling it to your face, it easily makes your skin flawless. It covers your dark spots, acne, blemishes and whatever it is. See the color is really really melts into your skin. Okay, so of course I need a good concealer to cover my dark circle. So I'm using the Boeing concealer from Benefit. Um, this time I'm using the airbrush Boeing concealer number three. It has a red undertone counter the dark circles under my eyes sometimes I'm also using it in the lid of my eyes as a base for my eyeshadows okay next what you need to do is to lock the concealer and all your foundation by tapping some powder I'm using the Pons BB cream powder color is so nice it's just adjusting automatically to your skin it feels so soft lightweight and has been my favorite and next for the eyes I like simplicity so I'm putting the eye stick from Sephora collection in misty brown for the eyeshadow yes only less than 30 seconds and I'm done with the eyeshadow next is the eyebrow I'm using the makeup forever aqua brow liner I have a thick eyebrow already so I'm not I'm not using any pencil to fill it in rather I just define the shape by using this product from makeup forever I love this Makeup Forever products from the Aqua line because it's much proof, sweat proof and never fade at all during the day. Next is for the eyeliner. I'm also using the same makeup brand, the Makeup Forever Aqua liner. Very precise, very easy to use and last all day on my eyes. Okay, next step is putting the bronzer. I'm using the Tarte 24 hours Amazonian clay bronzer. By far Tarte is my most favorite brand because they are cruelty free, they are vegan, they are also parabens free. Also put this bronzer to define the nose shape a little bit I'm using my fingers because it tends to be more blendable with fingers but then if you feel that it's still too harsh you can use the blending brush just to remove the edge
and a bigger brush to blend 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 it seamlessly next is I'm using the Too Faced highlighter love light highlighter in ray of light as you know the Too Faced uh, has launched this product just maybe early this year and I love the texture it's very light not really too much for daily use and the color is so subtle next for the blush on I'm using the hourglass ambient lighting blush in mood exposure I like this plummy color but turns out to be a dusty rose on the cheek also very high-end product that never disappoints me okay last touch for my eyes is of course mascara I put my eyelash color and then I'm using the Clio mascara I think Clio is one brand from Korea but then I you can find it in Sephora This mascara is really waterproof, so I need an oil-based makeup remover to take it off before bed. And then the last touch, of course, for the lipstick. I've been loving my, um, the made lipstick, so this time for daily use, I love using this Maybelline Make Lipstick in Mood Nuance. The color is like a brownish pink and not too strong for daily makeup going to the office or just hang out and yeah that's it 10 minutes huh so now you can believe that I'm preparing everything in 10 minutes in my morning so I hope you can enjoy this video See you next time.